Hello and welcome to your daily dose of Minecraft, the series where I showcase some of the work done from the Minecraft community. And as always, all clips used in this series will be linked down below in the description. But let's get right into the video, because I really do hate long intros. A player by the name of Meter Stickman was annoyed by his friend who kept cutting down his tree. So he left him a little trap and he captured it with the camera mod. And the outcome is hilarious. <laughs> Our next clip is so satisfying. The same person, Meter Stickman, made a very cool way of collecting mob loot in his grinder. What happens is the loot gets funneled into this honey wall and then it slowly falls down, making for this really cool and satisfying way of obtaining his loot. Here's a link as well as everyone else's will be down below in the description and I do urge you guys to actually check them out. They make some good stuff. Using command blocks, Kevin JN made a working 3D hologram using coloured particles and looks incredible. It feels like this isn't even Minecraft. Within the latest snapshot for Minecraft Java Edition, we actually got the new Axolotl mob. And here are all the different types of variations. A player by the name of Oakstar has just proven everyone wrong when everyone says you can't have circles in Minecraft. Using armor stands and command blocks, he has made the perfect circle. Kevin JN has converted Google Earth into Minecraft. Just saying that feels insane. How is that even possible? Well, I actually took it upon myself to look into it a little further. It takes a lot of different softwares and conversions of different metadata, but it's very possible and the outcome you get from it is very worth it. Kill it with fire, kill it with fire, kill it with fire. Twiggy Pancakes has made nightmare fuel in this image. This next clip is pretty cool. Every 5 seconds, a new maze is generated randomly. Meaning you'll never do the same maze twice. I would love to see this in some kind of Minecraft server lobby. It'd be so entertaining. Imagine getting a rank at the end of it, where you can only actually play survival mode if you complete the maze. The server would only have like one person, and that would be the admin. If you're enjoying the video so far, please consider liking and subscribing. It would be awesome if this video can get 100 likes. I've never seen a shield break that fast. That's actually crazy. I make a shield and it will last me like the entire playthrough, but this guy's shield just broke in seconds. I didn't know this, but apparently when you take damage from a cactus, or probably just any kind of damage, you actually get a little jump boost. So a player called Crewfit has actually made a custom parkour using that, and it does look like a lot of fun. If you were this guy, how would you even get out of this situation? Is his world now just a complete write-off? This player was experimenting with a few roller coaster concepts and he built this really satisfying loop. But that's it for this Daily Dose episode. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe. It'd be awesome if this video could get 100 likes. If you enjoy the series, there is actually a playlist dedicated to it where you can watch all the videos in one spot. If not, I've got two more videos on screen I think you will enjoy.